All right, legends, welcome back. So in this video, we're gonna learn how to play around with our audio a little bit. So there's a couple things you might wanna do with your audio. You might just want to change the volume. You might wanna lower it. You can just click on each individual clip. Again, always make sure that the yellow border is around that individual clip. And actually, let's click on this one. Looks like there's more audio. And you can see your audio right down here. This is when these little lines, these little kind of like uh, lie detector lines, when they go high, that means that there's a lot of audio. And you can change the volume just by turning it down like that. Or you can raise the audio. So let's play it. I don't know if you're going to be able to hear it or not. You hear that? Like the crackling of the GoPro or the wind in the background. You can also, this isn't too accurate. See how it just goes from like 45, then you barely move it to 32. You can go up here, make sure you're still on the same clip. We're going to go up here to this little icon above our preview screen. And I can control it right there. I can bring it down to 4 or 5%. You know what? I'm just going to kill it because... I'm going to add voiceover to all this stuff. I don't want any wind in the background. I don't want any of the whatever me and my buddy were saying as we homebrewed. Also, we can just delete this. If we want to play a song the whole time and not have any of the audio from our clips, you know, kind of uh, compete with it. So what we would do is we would go to make sure you're on the clip. Instead of clicking split clip, we would go to detach audio. And then I could just go ahead and delete it just like that. If you want to keep the audio, so now there's no audio, it's just at zero. Now, if you want to keep the audio, but delete the video, so say you're doing like an interview and you want the audio from the interview to keep going, but you also want to show some different clips of maybe what the interviewer is talking about, what we could do is go like this. We'll go to, we'll click on this and we'll go to detach audio and I'm going to click on my detached audio. I'm going to click copy or control C or command C if you're on a Mac. I'm going to copy that and I'm going to go back to this. It's going to delete both of them as well, but then we can just click copy, <laughs> command V, and it comes back just like that. So you have that audio for that clip. You just don't have the video for that clip. If you guys have any questions, comments, post them in the comment section below and uh, good luck with this. I'll see you guys in the next video.